her and she's got some conjunctivitis. We had a little girl with conjunctivitis in the herd and we've also got a little girl that likes to lick eyes so it's been spreading around. So what we do when they've got something like this, a little sore eye, an infection or conjunctivitis, we've got some sterile saline on a clean cotton ball, make it nice and wet, keep her nice and calm and just clean her eye off because they do tend to get a little bit of discharge. Be nice and gentle because it is going to be sore and then we'll get another clean piece of cotton wool and we'll do exactly the same and we'll wipe again until there's no crustiness left around her eye. Make it nice and clean and then still holding her nice and close we've got some antibiotic cream. Now you would have asked your vet for this and we just hold her nice and still and place about one centimetre of the cream into her eye. There we are and just gently massage it in and calm. There we go. And then we'll check her other eye because she's got one infection. So we'll get another clean piece of cotton wool, some more sterile saline, nice and wet. And we'll just give this eye a wipe. And we'll just check it over. And she's a little bit sore on the inside of her eye. So we'll take our cream and we'll put some cream in this eye too, just to make sure it doesn't get any more sore. There we go. Gently massage it in. There, and she's all done. And we'll do that for about five days. Keep an eye on it. And if you think it's getting too sore, she can go back to the vets and get some different eye drops or different cream. It should all be gone in about a week, shouldn't it, Pippa? And then we can give her a nice treat. Say, so well done. So it's really important to practice good hand hygiene. When you've got something like conjunctivitis, it is contagious. It can pass to all the other pigs, as it has done here, because we've had somebody licking some eyes and then lick another eye, and it passes along. So after you've done your treatment, really important to wash your hands thoroughly you don't want to be spreading it to yourself or your children or your other pets it's a contagious thing and it will spread easily so practice good hand hygiene so if you get lots of pigs like Pippa into the rescue they can have minor illnesses and something like that can spread easily and it always needs vet treatment or a vet consultation and that means that the prices ramp up, the vet's bills ramp up, and it all adds up. So all donations that come into us can be really useful towards mounting vet's bills, just for the little things that just mount up really quickly and easily into quite a big hefty bill.